Zeke, is Shirley all right? She's out of danger, for now. But it still doesn't look good. Uh, this is all my fault. Can she be treated? The shelter's only equipped with basic medical equipment. We've done all we can. Celine is trying to contact some friends in Banjis to see if any of them can help. I'm going to talk to Franz. He's got some connections. Maybe he'll have some ideas. Please take care of Shirley while I'm gone. I'll be back as soon as I can. I overheard you guys. Zeke, he's gone to see Franz, right? Well, how is it? Give it to me straight, Doc. I'm so sorry. I made everyone so worried. I... Sorry. I'm feeling a little hungry. Could you get me something? <laughs> Anything, really. Thanks. Shirley? Shirley! Where'd she go? In her current condition. I need to find her now. Shirley, what are you doing out here? I... I just wanted to see the stars. I'm sorry, I just... I just want to be alone. Just for a little while. 
When we were little, Zeke used to take me out here to gaze at the stars. I like it here. It's so quiet and peaceful, like all the bad things in the world just didn't exist. I wish things could be like back then. Forever. I... I didn't want to make Zeke sad. Shirley, are you okay? I... what am I gonna do? Shirley! I'm sorry, Zeke. This was all my fault. It's not your fault. Her condition's worse than we thought. I should have been watchful. We did a full checkup on her. Her conditions are not stable and may take a turn for the worst at any time. Celine's friends are coming to help, but they won't be here at least until tomorrow. We don't have that kind of time. <sighs> I need your help again. There's someone. Someone who may have a way of saving Shirley. There's an abandoned lab near the northern coast of Astra. Just send the word there. Also, please don't mention this to anyone else in the shelter. I'm sorry. I can't tell you the identity of that person. You're the only one in the shelter who can help me. This place looks like it's been abandoned for quite some time. I wonder if anything still works. This data. Chrono chambers? The coordinates look like they're near the shelter.
You should at least wait until someone's home before you visit. I'm very sorry. I'm here to deliver a message and didn't mean to look through your things. Why are you here, stranger? Zeke's sister was seriously wounded, so he asked me to look for help here. We will take care of that. Please leave if you have nothing else. Hello? Hello? <sighs> I really hope they can help Shirley. Why is everyone saying those things? That's the way things are around there. If one of us changed, the closest to them will have to put them down. At the very least, they can go with some dignity. None of us wanted to see this happen to Shirley. But Zeke, he... Paul and I will stay here to keep everyone calm. As for Zeke... 
I'll go check on them. Zeke, she's suffered enough. She's not dead yet. Can't you see the reality of things? She's already... Don't jump to conclusions so easily, Franz. She will be given a new life. <laughs> a new life? As what, a clone? Droid? Or maybe something like you? Isn't it rather superficial to cast judgment on what life is or is not? It is time. Let us go. Zeke, I pray you know what you're doing. I'm gonna bring her home. Guess you saw all of that, huh? Who is that with Zeke? Just an old acquaintance. Nothing more. She said there's still hope for Shirley. Is that true? <sighs> From what I know, aberration is irreversible. The only thing we can do for the afflicted is to send them on their way. As humans. But Shirley... I don't know how they're planning to save her, but even if they did, would Shirley still be the same Shirley that we knew? You look like you have something to say. Hmm. Zeke sent you to see that person, right? You knew? I should have known that's what Zeke would do. So what did they tell you? I didn't exactly get to meet them. I only requested their help via a communication device, and they said that they would. I also found something that looks like an experiment log. It mentions something called the Chrono Chamber. The Chrono Chamber? Ah, oh, you sly fox. How could I have missed it? Who's Zeke looking for? The leader of the heirs of Ida goes by the codename Sage. Even within their organization, he's shrouded in mystery. If he really was on Astra, everything that's happened so far would be the least of our troubles. <sighs> Let's head back to the shelter. We have to tell them about what's happened. and left with someone. Why didn't you stop him? Stop him? You know him better than I do. Hmm. So who exactly was it? The heirs of Ida. They claim that they can save Shirley. For Zeke, the choice was clear as day. Heirs of Ida? The crazy bunch that tried to overthrow Hykros? How did they get mixed into this? Zeke is hiding something, isn't he? Hmm. You found something, didn't you? I found some of Zeke's things that may connect the dots. I left them on the table over there.
I can see it. Your sorrow. Your sadness. Your weakness. I can see all your self-pity. Cursing your cruel fate. But calamity is not without hope. The root of the curse has long been buried. It is etched deep within your bones. Inundated in flesh and blood. You have all forgotten how the world used to be. You have all forgotten. This world belonged to humanity. But mortals are puppets of desire. They raise the Tower of Fantasy, grasping at Omnium from above. How grand, how ridiculous. Those on the ground cower in the shadows, while the pestilential aberration runs rampant, and the fools behind this sit high above in Hycros, in their foolish attempt to rebuild a new order that is merely a trap, and the rest of humanity are but flies. Lost lambs, have you sincerely repented? When will the savior you call for arrive? Knock hard at the gates of fate. The fertile soil will be sowed with your own hands. Heirs of Ida, there is no need to mourn the dead. The gates of heaven are never closed. I will witness every sacrifice with my own eyes. They will bring about a new order. And this world will be reborn from ashes. No doubt that person in the video is the mysterious sage. Looks like Zeke had been in contact with the heirs of Ida for a while now. The two kids are Zeke and Shirley. Their parents were members of the heirs of Ida. What? Why hasn't Zeke mentioned this before? He probably just wanted a normal life. After witnessing what happened to their parents, I'm sure Zeke wouldn't want Shirley and himself to share a similar fate. But now, Shirley's become the heirs of Ida's greatest bargaining chip. They want Zeke, and Zeke would do anything to save his sister. Could the heirs of Ida be behind the Ravager's attack? I can't say for sure, but I know that they're willing to do anything it takes to achieve their goal. We must get Zeke back. We can't let him be a pawn of those lunatics. Leave it to me. I'll find Zeke. The heirs of Ida are not to be taken lightly. You don't have to do this. They saved my life. I'm only returning the favor. Enthusiasm alone can't find Zeke. If you need help, you can start with the chrono chamber mentioned in the lab journal. It was one of the secret facilities built by Hykros half a century ago. The ruins outside the shelter is another. It was abandoned after the cataclysm. Who knows what's down there? If you're going in, be careful. I'm going to Hykros and inform them of everything that happened here. Maybe they can help. Anyway, I'll see you. Your conversation. 
Will you really be able to bring Shirley and Zeke back? Mia can sense the internal emotional circuits surging. <laughs> Shirley and Zeke are important companions. Alas, I am a malfunctioning smart servant, but if I may be of assistance in any way, please take me with you. All right, let's go and come home together, all four of us. the chrono chamber you mentioned? What does it actually do? Peanut has entered hibernation mode. It cannot provide more information. Might be dangerous inside. Wait for me by the entrance. Thank <laughs> you. 
the hyenas get in here?
The barrier disappeared. The exit should be up there.